Hello everyone, I'm here to review the uh, Hoover Wind Tunnel 2, the high capacity for uh, pets. Uh, we had just purchased this about, I don't know, about probably four or five weeks ago. It's a good unit. I paid uh, $100 online for it. Uh, generally in the store, it sells for about $145. They say MSRP is $299, but I'm, I doubt that that's what they, they actually sell it for. Uh, so... Some of our vacuum cleaners have been dying out. We just spent $500 for simplicity. It died out. We uh, had a couple other uh, ones, but we decided, hey, it's $100. Let's go for the Hoover uh, high capacity. We obviously have uh, two dogs. Um, there's one of our monsters right down there, if you can see him. And you probably can't. He's the reason why we got to get, uh, you know, obviously uh, a pet vacuum. And we got another golden over there at this end of the house. So these are the two reasons why we got to actually, uh, you know, look for a pet vacuum. So most of these vacuums, they burn out because, you know, we have the pets. So we decided to go with uh, this uh, wind tunnel too. And it does actually seem to be working pretty good. It does uh, suck a lot harder than most of the... Uh, the vacuums that we've had in the past it comes with this uh this nice detachment at the top here that uh that pulls pet hair off of uh you know couches and chairs as you can see our dog just transferred over here so now we got to clean off this couch uh you know we also it also comes with this uh the wand a standard wand and it also comes with this other uh, attachment here just uh so you can vacuum along the carpet again or uh, maybe long drapes or something. Um, it has three different levels of height. Um, you know, one being hardwood floor, two low carpet, all the way up to five high carpet. We have a pretty high carpet here. Uh, you know, the, the, the vacuum does, like I said, mention it does suck pretty well. Uh, it just has your standard bristles yeah. on the bottom. Nothing, nothing fancy. You know, just, uh, you know, your standard one level bristle. And it does, uh, have on the inside a, a nice, uh, HEPA filter, you just disconnect it at the top here, and uh, if you flip this uh, trigger on the inside, you can see the filter at the top. It doesn't really blow out any dirt or dust yet, um, and we've had it for a couple of weeks, so that's that's really good. Uh, and also, you can see it's full of pet hair. This is just for a week, so our dogs are really losing a lot of hair, but you can see that it's actually picking it up quite a bit. You know, so this is just a week of our dogs. You know, that's a golden retriever and a, a pit mix. That's what we get for those guys. Um, you know, it does uh, connect in here nice and tight. This side connection goes up against the rubber seal here, which is good because most of the seals are plastic. And uh, you lose your air along there. Uh, the only thing we really don't like on it is if you can see along the back here, the cord does not retract. You know, it's one of those ones that you just wind around the, the top. You know, so it's not a big deal, um, but uh, for for most you know people, they don't uh, they don't wind up the top. You know, they they don't wind it. This is this is what it comes back at. It comes like this. So my wife never winds it up. She just sets it here on the top, and that's it. So you, I don't even see the sense. And you're you're cleaning up stuff, and then you make a mess. So I mean, if you can handle winding it up, then you'll be all right. Um, it is a little bit heavier than most vacuums, but uh, it seems to be a heavy duty vacuum you know um, I wouldn't have a, a light vacuum and then have it not suck as much so uh, I guess out of all I would say it's, it's probably about a four and a half stars out of five uh, you know for the price you paid $99 delivered so you can't go wrong with that it's a Hoover it's a, it's a great brand came in brand new no issues had delivered uh, you know like I said everything seems to be working okay uh, you know it does have a, a fairly long